News right now at the airport as we take a live look from our iCam in Windsor Locks. Yes, we'll be able to see some of the snow on the uh, road nearby there at the lower part of the screen. You can also see the runway off in the distance right there. The airport is open, but that does not mean anyone is really getting anywhere. Absolutely. Channel 3's Hector Molina joins us live at Bradley International Airport right now. And Hector, a lot of people's plans were definitely inconvenienced today. According to FlightAware, Bradley International Airport has had 41 cancellations in the past 24 hours. One of them was supposed to be Julie Bovaire's flight home to Orlando. She was supposed to leave yesterday, but this storm pushed the flight a day later. Were you surprised that yesterday got canceled and not today? Very. <laughs> yes, I was. Um, I guess rain's a no-go, but snow is okay. But not all planes were able to fly through the flakes. Maggie Brockmeyer and her friends weren't even supposed to fly out of Bradley, but the Nor'easter called for a change of flights and airports. We were originally supposed to fly out around 10.45 from Logan. Uh, that got canceled. Then we rescheduled for 7.50 p.m. That got canceled, and we were like, frantically checking anywhere, and they still had open flights here. So I was like, all right, get in the car. We're going. She went on to admit that she and her friends were blindsided by winter storm Brenda. Lots of stress, definitely lots of screaming and frantic calls and calls to the parents and stuff. But if we can get there and I can land in Florida, I think that will all wither away. Yeah, Brenda has had quite the impact on travel today. I want to give you a look at what's going on right now here at Bradley International Airport. We're seeing, I'll say for the most part, you see a lot of on time on this board, but you still see a good amount of those red and orange dots. Red obviously meaning canceled, orange obviously meaning delayed. So if you have a flight and plan on coming here to Bradley at all tonight, the airport is telling you to check in with your airline as soon as possible so you can get the most updated information on your flight status. We're live at Bradley International Airport in Windsor Locks tonight. Hector Molina, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.